Hello everyone, we can honestly already guess what you're thinking. You may be thinking that as soon as gravity disappears, you would start floating and flying over everything. Be your own Superman. It'd be awesome, right? Well, if you think that, you're in for quite a surprise, and not a pleasant one. Oh, and of course we'd all die. You're watching Top 10 World. Stay tuned till the end of the video to get your mind blown. What would happen first? Even though physics is pretty sure that this could never happen, but a man can imagine, right? So what if we could switch gravity off? Well, according to some extensive research and wisdom of numerous experts, our best guess at what would happen to you if gravity suddenly vanished is you will explode, like they do in the movies. Did that scare you? Huh, no, don't worry, not so fast, you guys. Here's an opinion from Jay Bucky, a physician and one-time NASA astronaut who went into the depths of how the absence of gravity affects the human body in a short TED lecture. According to the man, if the Earth's gravity did just suddenly disappear, even for as long as just 10 seconds, we would no longer have a force that would stick us to the ground. While the Earth might continue spinning, we would not be able to move like we can. Instead, we would move in a straight line. More specifically, upwards. If you feel like you would float away from Earth, then no, my friend. It'll actually be the other way around. The Earth would literally be dropping away from us. I mean, we have done enough damage for it to finally be able to run away from us monsters. Oh, and also, anything not stuck would move upwards too, just like us, float off into space. To give you a clearer picture of what would happen in the absence of gravity, you wouldn't float around aimlessly, instead, you'd be like tiny fast-moving tumbleweeds. Yes, all those movies just lied to you, there's no floating in slow motion happening here, especially because you'll be on Earth that would be busy falling out of its orbit. However, do not feel so let out because this would not only be you. Everything would start moving, which means all the buildings, even the fancy cars, houses of all sizes, and even thousand-year-old trees. Everything would start tumbling and rolling around the Earth. This really makes us thank God for the presence of gravity. Imagine the World Trade Center shooting in your direction. Remember, it's gravity that holds everything in place. In short, you can expect an apocalypse on a global scale since everything would start to detach from its roots and begin rolling, tumbling, and flailing randomly. Somewhat like what they show in those epic destruction movies, except much worse. Much, much, much worse. What would happen to the air? What about the air? Well, the sudden disappearance of gravity would not just make the buildings and trees go crazy, it will definitely affect the air and create an imbalance in the proportion of the gases. All the gases that are present in our atmosphere would float off into space too, which is quite alarming because that would mean this would leave anyone still left on Earth in need of an oxygen tank in order to keep breathing. If you're in luck, then the air supply in some buildings might last for a little while, but that too would soon be drawn off into space, which means you will suffocate to death if you don't get any oxygen supply whatsoever. Not only that, but anyone who gets injured will be out of luck more than any other person alive as the wounds would take longer to heal as the immune system loses its strength. All the gases running off into the space will result in Earth losing its atmosphere, which means there would be a sudden and drastic change in air pressure, which would mean an immediate and simultaneous rupture of the inner ears of every human being on the planet. Imagine your ear bursting and blood floating up towards the sky. Not a pretty image, is it? What about the lakes, rivers, and sea? Now that we're done with the gases and solids, let's jump to the liquids and oceans of the Earth. The massive 71% of Earth. You might have guessed the basics by now. It would leave the Earth's surface too and move towards the sky. And yes, expect those to move up in gigantic blobs. Make sure you don't get stuck in one. The temperature of Earth would rapidly start to rise once our atmosphere had disappeared. The temperature of Earth would quickly begin to rise once our air had vanished. Without our environment, we have no protection from the sun's blazing heat. It would enter to the Earth's surface and cause the water to get bubbling, going into steam that would glide off into space. What would happen to the whole Earth? Last but not least, it would be time to say goodbye to Mother Earth because the force that kept us binded and together would leave us. Structures and strong buildings would begin to separate, as would mountains, land, and rocks until, in the end, the entire Earth would fall to pieces 
and buoy away into space. That would slightly affect us as we would be a distant memory by that point. The reality of zero gravity. While researchers can possibly foresee what might occur in the event that we abruptly lose gravity on Earth, they can disclose to us the transient impact that absence of gravity would have on our bodies through their examination studying what happens to the space travelers while in space. At first, space travelers lose their feeling of direction. This can cause them to feel wiped out for some time. They additionally report feeling like their arms and legs are detached from their body. The change in air pressure can sometimes affect their vision. This might be because of the altered pressure on the eyeball, cerebrum, and spinal fluid. Due to the absence of weight on their bodies, their muscles and bones start to weaken. To neutralize this, they invest a great deal of their energy working out. An astronaut will really grow while in space. Without the pressing factor of gravity, their bodies can extend about an inch or more. This too is only temporary, and they soon return to their usual height on Earth. Gravity is one of four central forces that oversee our universe. The other three are comparably critical. Without electromagnetism and the strong and weak nuclear forces, molecules themselves would self-destruct. However, gravity is the one in particular that is genuinely a commonly recognized name, which is maybe why we are so intrigued by thoughts like repulsive force and anti-gravity and why the discovery of gravitational waves is so interesting, regardless of whether it will never touch any of our lives dire. This was all about what would happen if gravity disappeared on Earth for just 10 seconds which one of these shocked you the most? Are you ready if that would ever happen to us? Let us know in the comment box below. If you enjoyed this video, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give this video a thumbs up, and hit the bell icon.